why American Fork? American Fork is is, is home for me. It's uh, we li we've lived here for about uh, seven of the last like 12 years, and uh, we really like Utah County. I've been involved with American Fork Band program since 2002, when I was an undergraduate at Brigham Young University. I called Mr. Miller up and I said, hey, I'm this you know, college kid, I'd like to come teach your band. And he said, sure. Um, I met, met him for the first time at Delta, and uh, it's been a great relationship ever since. Uh, my role with the American Fork Band has been um, anywhere from uh, started out kind of as the visual guy. I kind of went in and you know helped them march better and look better, and and it kind of evolved as a, as my education grew. I worked more on the music, and now I kind of just um, as of late I've just kind of been there as a another opinion in Mr. Miller's ear, and um, and he's been great to work with. Uh, my experience being inside marching bands, uh, I, I was actually a student at Mountain Crest High School in the late 90s. Um, that started my love of marching band and um, and then I went on um, after high school and I, I marched in a couple of different drum and bugle corps. I marched with the uh, Velvet Knights and also the Concord Blue Devils, um, playing euphonium and baritone respectively in those organizations. American Forks band program is special for a lot of reasons, but the number one reason is the students. Uh, the students are very teachable, they're respectful, they're taught well from a very young age to be respectful and kind, and, um, and it really is a family environment in the American Fork Band, and that, that is, um, may, be, may not be unique for the students that are, that are in the organizations, but having taught um, other places around the country, it is a very unique uh, uh, characteristic of a band program, and that's what I love about it. There's there's a great community that supports the program. Um, I, I think that there are so many things that that are needed for a successful uh, marching band or a band program in general. And one is that you have to have great students. You have to have students who are willing to learn. You have to have people in the seats to play the instruments. But you also have to have the parental support, which American Fork Band is known all around the country for their amazing band booster organization, their amazing parent organization. Uh, and then the community at large, the community knows who the American Fork Band is and they, are, they want to support it. Well, the program is in a very good place right now. I, I often, uh, I stay awake at night ever since the, uh, the announcement. I, I stay awake at night and I have these, you know, dreams that, you know, no parents will show up to my booster meeting or, you know, I'll show up to the first day of class and I'll have three kids in the seats. You know, those are the sorts of nightmares that I have. Um, but the, the band is in a great place right now. And um, uh, my philosophy going forward is to, if it's not broken, we're not going to fix it. So my hope and my, uh, my goals going forward is to continue on what Mr. Miller has done. Uh, I don't want to change the world. I don't want to change a whole bunch of things. Um, I want to continue in the, the trajectory that Mr. Miller has taken it. Um, and that's, that's sort of my main focus and main goal and really to get to know the students right away.